The price of public safety coming up tonight before the Isabella County Commission, which is considering cuts to sheriff's road patrols to make up for a multi-million dollar budget shortfall. That shortfall, the result of a millage that failed by a wide margin in February. But as TV5's Raven Blue reports, voters are telling commissioners they want the issue back on the ballot. I ask you, I request of you, find a way to save our road patrol. Residents of Isabella County calling on the Board of Commissioners to put the operating millage back on the August ballot after voting it down in February. The rejection leaving the county with a $6 million shortfall and considering cuts at the Sheriff's Office of up to 19 positions such as detectives, sergeants, and road patrol operations, leaving residents worried about the safety of the community. There are 200 to 300 calls per week that the Isabella County Sheriff's Office currently responds to. What will happen? to all those calls for service if there's no road patrol to respond. I believe you and everyone in this room would agree if you were in need of their services that you'd be wishing it was mandated while you waited for no one to show up for you in your time of need. As a citizen, as an employee, I believe it's your obligation to figure out how to save the road patrol. That means finding the money some way or another, or if that means putting a public safety millage on this coming August ballot. Commissioners last week announced they were considering the cuts and on Tuesday they heard from people who say the February millage failed because voters were not well informed. Almost everybody I spoke to did not understand. I did the math. My taxes were only going to go up maybe $300 a year. It's not the 37 or 38 percent that we were told. You didn't do your job to educate the public about the financial implications of the February ballot. You didn't do your job. Because of the failed millage, the board last month voted unanimously to approve a hiring freeze for all general fund positions. If it is unable to make up the shortfall, the layoffs at the sheriff's office would take effect at the end of September. Raven Blue, WNEM TV5.